My name is Gina Seervogel and I'm a senior lecturer at the Department of Environmental and Geographical Science at the University of Cape Town. I did a Bachelor of Science in Environmental and Geographical Science and Oceanography here at the University of Cape Town. I then went to Rhodes University where I did my honours in Environmental Water Management um, and I did my PhD at the University of Oxford in Geography. I was rated a NRF National Research Foundation uh, P-rated Young Scholar. Um, I've been awarded uh, an award for open courseware on developing material that is open source and a module called Vulnerability to Environmental Change. I've been awarded a UCT College of Fellows Young Scholar Award here at UCT. I'm particularly um, focused on the Millennium Development Goal of ensuring environmental sustainability. The work I do is about adapting to climate impacts and ensuring that this is done through the lens of social development. Currently I'm involved in a project called FLOW, Fostering Local Wellbeing, and to me this is a really exciting project because it brings together the local community and we're working with youth who've been unemployed to bring them into a project where they're called FLOW Ambassadors, but we're also working with the local municipality to look at how they are developing and supporting adaptation to climate change. One of the things I believe is very important is working on engaged scholarship and working with communities and local government. So in the next five years I see myself developing this work and working collaboratively with these different groups to find innovative solutions. So one of the things I think we need to do in addressing both the Millennium Development Goal of environmental sustainability and reducing poverty and inequality is looking at transformation. What are new ways we can do things? What are new ways we can work together as communities? We can reduce environmental risk. We can challenge the current status quo and the current policies and ways that we work so we can be more collaborative and inclusive and address risks more holistically.